Last Temptation was shown at the Carlton Cinema in O'Connell Street as part of the Dublin Film Festival. The American author of the screenplay, Paul Schrader, joined a hundred cinema-goers for the showing. Outside the cinema, two protesters said the rosary, but the expected public demonstrations never materialised. It's mostly being attended by people who are particularly interested in Paul Schrader and seeing all of his films during the festival. Have you had any complaints about the festival's decision to show the film? None at all. Patrons entering the cinema were greeted by a sign reminding them that the film was a fictional account of Christ's life. The sign was one of the conditions imposed by the censor when he gave the film a certificate for general release. Cinema chains now have to decide whether to show the film. Well, we'll decide on that in the course of the next few days and we'll come to a decision next Monday whether we show the film or not. Well, we don't sit here as a, as a form of second censorship. Would you be concerned about protests against the film such as there have been in Paris and Greece? Well, we're very conscious of the situation that happened in France and indeed in Greece. And it's against that background that we have delayed the decision to show the film. But if we do decide to show the film, we will take maximum security uh, on the house for the protection of, of the public and indeed the staff alike. After the showing, reactions from the cinema goers were mixed. I didn't see what all the fuss was about. This is good I, know, I thought the whole sequence at the end was a bit pointless. And I think, I mean, Christians would find it offensive. Uh, it was a bit long. It wasn't, wasn't what I thought it would be. I don't see what all the controversy was about, you know. I would imagine that on the whole it would be boring for a general audience, but um, I like photography and I enjoy the photography in it. I thought it was very spiritual, but not offensive, definitely not offensive. It was more philosophical than I expected. Like, you get a lot of people sort of going, oh my god, you know, it has, it has, you know Jesus and, and Bonk Cray, Shock Horror, all this kind of thing. It's nothing really like it at all. What did you think of it? <laughs> Tedious.